Hello and welcome to another video on the Knight Ministries channel. I am your host, Jeremy Knight. Don't forget to like the video and enjoy the show. Okay. Hello. This is my Halloween special. So, uh, happy Halloween. In this video, we will be talking about um, just a few things I remember from my uh, memory. I'm not going to be doing any actual research for this video. It's, I'm just going to be saying things I remember from up here. But we're going to be talking about Halloween. Uh, where it really comes from, and guess what? It's not pagan. Halloween is not pagan in any way, shape, form, or matter. It really isn't. It's the whole myth about Halloween being pagan is just that, a myth. There, there's no real proof or evidence that it is pagan, but people love to say it is. It isn't pagan at all. It's actually completely Christian in origin. But yeah, that's what we're going to be discussing in this video. The uh, true origins of Halloween. Just what I remember from up here. No actual research. I've been dealing with these people that don't like celebrating Halloween for so long. I've basically memorized a lot of the refutes against them. It's perfectly okay to celebrate Halloween. There's nothing wrong with celebrating Halloween. There really isn't. A Christian can celebrate Halloween all he or she wants to. Go have fun on Halloween. Happy Halloween. Okay, so the main myth that uh, is very popular about Halloween, about how Halloween is supposedly pagan. It really isn't, though. But the main myth is that Halloween originates from a Celtic festival known as Samhain. Or Samhain. I'm not really sure how it's pronounced. I think it's supposed to be pronounced Samhain. But... Uh, I might put the spelling on the screen. The spelling is very different from the pronunciation for some weird reason. But anyways, a lot of the myths that you hear about Sawin are not even relatively true. Sawin isn't what most of the evangelicals and... Uh, Neo-Puritans, that's what they're called, Neo-Puritans. They're, they're the people that uh, want to try and ruin all the holidays. They're called Neo-Puritans. They want to try to ruin all the holidays, try to ban all the holidays, and apparently they love starting with Halloween. They come out of the woodworks every year around this time. Neo-Puritans. They're really a pain. But anyways... Um, the myths that Sawin was a... Uh, pagan holiday celebrating death and worshipping death and dressing up in costume. Yeah, all of those are modern day myths spread by the Neo-Puritans and some of the Evangelicals. But mostly the, the Neo-Puritans. Uh, 
Um, yeah, those myths are completely false, and none of them are true. There's no evidence supporting any of those myths, and yeah, literally, literally none of them are true. If you do the research, you will find out that there is no evidence supporting any of those myths. You just, you just have to dig past all the uh, myths that the Neo-Puritans have uh, spread all across the internet. You, you have to dig past all of those myths. Uh, one easy way to dig past them is watch the videos by uh, Inspiring Philosophy. If you watch the videos by Inspiring Philosophy, they can really dig past all of the Neo-Puritan myths. It's really just a modern day myth. All Halloween really is, is just the eve of All Saints Day. Halloween is one of these holidays that we uh, carried over from Catholics. So all this hate against Halloween is basically just anti-Catholic sentiment. And this Protestant, this Protestant right here, won't stand for anti-Catholic sentiment. I think us Protestants and the Catholics should uh, be friends. We should be friends. Halloween used to be known as All Hallows' Eve. And All Saints' Day is also known as All Hallows' Day. And basically, the word Halloween came about by slurring together the words All Hallows' Eve. It, people slurred those words together over time, and eventually those three words got compacted into Halloween. So, that's where the word comes from. But yeah, the... Halloween is a completely Christian holiday with most of its uh, celebrations and traditions coming from uh, American and European folk traditions. So it's mostly American and European folk traditions that have the whole costumes and all that stuff. But basically, yeah, Halloween is completely Christian. There, there really isn't anything pagan about it at all. Just that people like to think it is. It really isn't pagan at all. But go watch the Inspiring Philosophy videos on TikTok, and I think they might have a few on the YouTube as well. So that's Inspiring Philosophy. I really like their videos. They they do a lot of good work. There are a few things that I disagree with them on, but this ain't one of them. This isn't one of them. I I agree with them on this. Halloween is an awesome holiday. I love Halloween. It's perfectly okay to celebrate Halloween. Have fun celebrating Halloween. Happy Halloween. Halloween is just basically innocent fun. It's dressing up in costume for innocent fun, gathering candies. Um, you gather candy. You go around to houses and gather candy and you dress up in costume. It's basically just innocent fun. That's all it really is. It isn't worshipping death. It isn't worshipping Satan. All of that stuff is just modern day myth. There's no evidence to support it whatsoever. It's 
innocent fun. That's all Halloween is, is just innocent fun. There really is nothing you can say that will make me stop celebrating Halloween. Because I know all of those myths out there surrounding Halloween trying to say that, it, that it's a pagan holiday when it really isn't are just that, myths. There, there's no truth to them whatsoever. There really isn't. They're just myths. Halloween is just innocent fun. It's a completely Christian holiday, completely Christian in origin, with the fact that Halloween is just all Hallow's Eve, a, a holiday that the Protestants borrowed from the Catholics. That's, that's really what it is. It's just a holiday that the Protestants borrowed from the Catholics. In fact, um, Halloween being celebrated on October 31st actually goes back to Germanic origins, not Celtic origins. It goes back to Germanic origins. All Saints Day was celebrated on November 1st in Germanic countries and and in the Germanic part of the world. And that put All Hallows Eve on October 31st. So, yeah. That's how it got on October 31st. Germanic origins. And it's always been a holiday of uh, dressing up in costume and gathering candy. It's innocent fun. It used to be a holiday of feasts at one point in time. In fact, that's kind of where the Halloween parties come from. They come from the feasting part of the celebration. But yeah, all, all those myths are false. All of them. I will always enjoy Halloween. And you should enjoy Halloween, too. Happy Halloween. From what I can tell, it looks like Halloween has become nothing but uh, capitalism. Because nobody really dresses up in traditional Halloween costumes anymore. I mean, every now and then you'll run across the traditional Halloween costume. You know, things like... Uh, Zombies, um, werewolves, vampires, skeletons, ghosts, ghouls, scarecrows, you know, the traditional Halloween costumes. Which, again, is not worshipping death because that's not what Halloween is about. Halloween is innocent fun. We dress up as that stuff to mock the demons. We, we dress up as that stuff to mock the demons. That's the idea. But nobody really dresses up as that anymore. Every now and then you might find someone dressing up in a traditional Halloween costume. But it's to mock the demons, not to worship them. Nobody worships them. That's not what Halloween is about. Halloween is a major Christian holiday. It's to honor the saints. That's what Halloween is about. Honoring the saints. And it's innocent fun. Halloween is about gathering candy 
Halloween is about gathering candy and having fun with your friends. That's what Halloween is about. Halloween is about making friends. It's about having fun with your friends. It's about gathering candy. That's what Halloween is about. But, yeah, Halloween has been exploited by capitalism, just like everything else. And now the majority of the Halloween costumes are superheroes from comic books. And other uh, sci-fi nerdy stuff. Like Star Wars, um, you have Lord of the Rings, uh, I've even seen a few Harry Potter costumes. But yeah, Halloween has been exploited by capitalism, just like every other thing holiday. Every other major holiday has been exploited by capitalism, and Halloween is no different. It's also been exploited by capitalism. This isn't a bad thing, but it's just something I wanted to mention. Okay. Happy Halloween. Go celebrate Halloween. I will always celebrate Halloween. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. <laughs> Happy Halloween. <laughs> Just thought I would throw in that. Happy Halloween. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and ring the bell. And follow me on Twitter and join my Discord. This has been a video on the Knight Ministries channel. I am your host, Jeremy Knight, and I just want to say, see you next time.